Hey there, Mediocre Hunter channel. Super glad you guys are here with us. We finally did it. We finished the addition to the blind. It's amazing. And I want to thank my friend Les, uh, my son Vincent, his friend Miles for doing the uh, brute force and getting these walls together. For those of you who have not seen the original video of how to build these blinds, please check out my link at the end of the video. Basically, you have eight by eight sections and you can build as many as you want. You can build a little village if you want to. And in fact, I think I'm gonna do that. But anyway, I wanna give you a tour of the blind, show you how this all uh, turned out. Hope you enjoy it. Please uh, subscribe if you like the content and leave your questions. I think a lot of people are gonna have some questions about how we did this. We definitely had to do some Yankee ingenuity. The walls weren't quite exactly even, so to speak, but we made it uh, work. Uh, thanks so much for joining us and we'll see you soon. first part here um, was the original and then we built the addition down that way and I'm just gonna take you through this here a little bit so here's the gaming chair that I showed you the video on before um, that's the main kind of hunting area my little table here to kind of keep my supplies and you know I usually let my gun kind of hang up there because it's an easy uh, it's an easy pickup. It doesn't make a lot of noise. That's a little inverter over there for some AC power. And I really wanted to put this uh, this lounging chair in because uh, I think it's important to uh, to stay comfortable. And then what I did here is we uh, punched out this wall uh, to come into the addition. And I wanted to be able to sleep two people in here. So you see, we've got two beds in here. I built the bed frame on the on the left and just kind of bought the the metal one from uh, from Amazon. I didn't really want to put a door in here, so I just, I the rough edges there, I put some kind of pipe insulation here just to kind of make it so you don't cut yourself because they're kind of sharp. I didn't really want to sand it all. So let's just kind of come on in here so I can check, show you the the, uh, the bedroom. And I got a little light nightstand, you know, against two people can sleep here. And we're going to kind of turn around here. I have a fan over there and a little table because it does get hot in here, especially during bear season. Uh, this is just nice and spacious. I built a little coat hanger rack up there for some of the, some of the gear. Yeah, and so here I am in my rocker chair. I got this at a flea market for pretty much nothing, and so I thought it'd be perfect for here because you do have to relax when you're hunting. Now, I, I wanna show everyone this because I upgraded the uh, the facilities uh, right there. Uh, we'll, get, uh, we'll get a little toilet paper rack up there, and then eventually I'm gonna have some water, uh, a little water tank up there and, and let gravity kinda, kinda feed down. We got a situation where we got two beds, a nice little living area, heat, electricity, and of course, we need the view of the field. 